Hello viewers, uh, in this video actually I'm going to show you that how to test uh, the sensors of uh, your devotes. Uh, it's not only that you can, I'm showing you about this devote, all devotes, the sensor, how to test is the function is the same actually you can test. Uh, normally actually we test it for, for example the anti-drop sensor we test on the table whether it's held or not, that one is I mean the manually we can test. But if uh, you physically you want to see, you want to see with your eyes whether the sensor really functioning or not. Because our normal, I mean the physical eyes, we cannot see like this uh, whether the sensor functioning or not. But I will show you easy way you can test at home also. Uh, if you, for example, some customers say that our, I mean the devote is hitting with the balls or the furniture and uh, that one is a light color but still it's hitting. So they can test the bumper or uh, the other sensors at home. I'll show you in this video that how to test those sensors. In all models, this function is the same. You can test with your mobile phone. Just you need only your mobile camera. You just turn it on your mobile camera, and then I show you that how to test. Okay, so from here I can show you that uh, this one is the LDS, the top cover of uh, the laser distance sensor assembly. LDS mean actually is a laser distance sensor assembly which create the I mean build the map actually. So here you can see inside it's turning. So we stop here at one position, and here you can see there's a red color dot. That one actually is a laser distance sensor assembly functioning, it's turning properly, it's normal, it's functioning and you can see the laser also is functioning. Uh, with our physical eye we cannot see the laser like this but with the camera you can use the mobile camera and you can see, see it's functioning and uh, it means that it's functioning normal, the laser distance sensor is no problem. And the bumper I just show you here, as you can see in the camera, uh, if, uh, uh, yes here, so here you can see there's a red color dot here. Here's the red color dot, so you just keep turning like this, so you can see the red color dots here. The whole bumper got uh, one up, one down, one up, one down, one up and one down here. You can see these are actually the sensors in front bumper. So if, uh, I mean, your uh, devote is hitting with the furniture or the obstacles and that one is a light color, uh, so you can test at home first like this whether your bumper sensor is uh, functioning or not. If you don't see this red color light, it means that there's something wrong with the bumper or maybe the wire connection loosen or maybe the bumper is not functioning so you can contact with the I service center. The sensor, I, how the sensor work actually. Some customers they complain that, uh, that it go direct and hit our furniture hit our uh, door or the wall like this so whenever i ask them that uh, whether you are uh, in your house furniture is a dark color or the light color so i let you know about one thing if there's a dark color or the black color or the dark brown colors so the sensor will not work over there this is normal actually infrared sensor once the rays come out they hit with the dark color they cannot bounce back so the i mean the devote will not catch back the signals from the uh, I mean from black black color so that's why it will touch that black color this is normal all infrared sensors are like this not only ecovax other models also other companies also all infrared sensor is the same once the rays come out if they touch with the black color they will not bounce back so of course once they will not bounce back so it cannot catch back the signal so it will touch that obstacle this is normal so that's why actually if there's a dark color furniture on the wall so the devote touch that one that one is normal if you want to test whether the devote is okay or not the bumper okay or not you can put the devote facing to the wall like is a light color one or like this type or you can facing to the any other light color or you're facing to the door you then you can run the devote if it hit direct the light color also it means that there's something wrong with the sensor then you can contact with the service center no problem and the other thing is i let you know that uh, the sensors always actually is uh, not in one line like this. The sensors are here, here, like this. There's a little bit gap between the sensors actually. But uh, because in this model they already have uh, the LDA sensor, so that one also can do the mapping, so and can prevent from the obstacle. But in some other models, the previous models they don't have the LDS one. So in those models, uh, if uh, I mean there's a little bit gap between the sensors. So whatever, if uh, for example the chair leg or the table leg, so sometimes they can touch that because if the chair leg is between those two sensors, it can touch that one slightly like this. That one also is normal. So don't worry about this one if it hit like that. And uh, the one thing is, I let you know, is anti-drop sensor actually here. The front, side, and the here at the back got anti-drop sensor. But the one thing I let you know about anti-drop sensor, anti-drop sensor, they made for uh, four to five inch height only. If, I mean, like our uh, house, uh, the living room, the kitchen, or the, I mean, the, uh, our rooms, uh, the floor sometimes is a one inch only difference. One inch or one and a half inches uh, up and down like this. 
so it can go down that areas that one is normal so don't worry about that one so if there's a staircase it go down then okay something wrong with the sensors and the anti-drop sensor some customer if uh, you i mean think that the devote is not functioning properly it uh, i mean go down so here i show you you can see here this one is the anti-drop sensor this one is the back one here you can see the red dot functioning here also you can see the red dot it's functioning here also yes see the red color dot it means that it's functioning and this one also got it's functioning normal and from here also you can see the red color light and this one is the sixth one all six anti-drop sensors are functioning so this is an easy way how we can test our uh, sensor the LDS sensor or uh, the bumper sensor or the LDS I mean the bumper uh, in anti-drop sensors so all these sensors very easy to test at home you can try this one at home first if uh, still I mean you uh, you feel that it's not functioning normal got light also but still it's got some problem then you can contact with our service center if any the normal way how we can test at home with our mobile camera the whether our LDS or the bumper sensor or the anti drop sensor they're functioning or not all reports the sensor function is the same you can test with your mobile phone that's functioning or not if I mean you feel that uh, they got lights also but still uh, it's not functioning properly then you can contact with our service center Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this video, so please uh, subscribe and share with your friends. If any question you can ask in the comments, uh, we will reply for you. Thank you. Thank you very much.